Bowie. Yeah. 
we've been corrected once before on this tour. Goddamn, Brooklyn! I mean, not for nothing, but shame on you if you step through. The old dirty bastard. Which is my forehead for our intents and purposes. This next one, ladies and gentlemen, is gonna go out absolutely every single fucking night to the headbangers. Are there any fucking headbangers left on this Tuesday evening in Brooklyn? We got headbangers in the front. Do we have headbangers in the back? Alright! Every fucking arm in the air, headbangers front and center. You got no excuse. It's just headbanging, man. Ain't gonna do nothing but break your neck. Maybe later. So, headbangers to the front. Oh, don't hide now. Just because you put your arm down, I know where you are. But don't worry. I'll see your hair spinning later, all the way in the back from. Uh, the Echo CD, staring into the wrist side.
you got fucking this one spectacular example of what will become. It will blossom into a full-fledged entire pit. Chicken fight mosh pit. I don't know what you call it where you come from, but where I come from, this is the beginning of a chicken fight mosh pit. And you know what? If you want to make it interesting, we can make it an all-girl chicken fight mosh pit with this next song. Brooklyn, you got some hot girlfriends here tonight. I want to get a better view from this stage. Put them on your fucking shoulders. Teach them how to mosh right now. Do we have any other takers, ladies? Jesus, there aren't that many ladies now that I look at it. Well, we can have a regular chicken fight mosh pit. All we need are two people to do it. We got another one? Oh, we got another one! Ah, very good! We got two! That's enough to start! Ladies and gentlemen, keep this chicken fight mosh pit going. I give you implosion of eternity! <laughs>
from the day around the company died. Fucking save your weekend. Who gives a shit? Fucking copyright trademark, Doug Stanhope. <laughs>
small the original problem is, it's going to grow into bigger and bigger proportions. It gets completely out of control, and I'll give you a concrete example. Now the entire North American continent is on fire, producing a huge thermal updraft and creating an incendiary cyclonic macro system that forms a hemispheric megastorm, breaking down the molecular structure of the atmosphere and actually changing the laws of nature. Fire and water combine, burning clouds of flaming rain fall upward, gamma rays and solar winds ignite the ionosphere, creating huge clouds of ionized plasma. Bolts of lightning 20 million miles long begin shooting out of the North Pole, and the sky fills up with green shit. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 